Amiibo wouldn't connect, so I'm a couple minutes late. How are you guys? you guys I missed you guys I tried to go live from the campground and I don't know if you saw it but it had terrible Wi-Fi there so it didn't work too well but I was live for a few minutes and just to show you the campground so what's new hey Pamela so tonight I'm going to make a cross, a photo frame cross. Well, what I mean by photo frame is I'm going to add a photo frame to it so that you could add a picture of your choice. Um, the only thing is the photo frame I bought, which is this one, is I think going to be too big. So I ordered some from Amazon, and I think I'm going to not use this one because this one's too big. Of course, the Dollar Tree did not have the smaller ones. I looked twice, two different times. Hey, Virginia. Hey, Tina. How are you, girl? And um, so I looked two different times and they didn't have the smaller frame. So I finally thought, I'm going to look at Amazon. And of course, Amazon has everything. So that's where I got it. Hey, Deb. Hey, Nelly. How are you guys? So this is what I have so far. I'm going to do the ruffles. And... I'm going to, like I said, add a photo frame, but unfortunately, thank you, Pamela, you won't see me do that tonight because, well, we'll see what it looks like when I'm done, but I'm pretty sure this frame's going to be too big. Hey, Joanne. So, hey, Marianne. Okay, I am going to put the frame, put the uh, camera down. And uh, show you what I have so far. Hey, Sousa. Hey, Bonnie. We'll go from there. So I was watching one. Of, well, it was the first live. Hey, Melinda. Hi, Bonnie. If I didn't say hi to you already, it was the first live that I did after a crafters convention, and. I started, I, I was talking too, too much in the beginning, so I'm going to try not to do that. Hey, Linda. Hi, Sue Ann. So I'm going to try not to talk so much in the beginning. Hey, Mary Lou. And, um, but I try to give you guys a chance to come in, you know, because I know the clocks are all different. Hey, Sharon. Hey, Tammy. Hey, Heather. So, okay, I'm using 6-inch mesh on this. Hey, Karen, this is where I use my 6 Hey, MJ, I did enjoy camping. How are you feeling, girl? Did you guys see the picture of the alligator? <laughs> I, always, I always show you alligators when we go camping. Isn't that fun? So, well, that's good, Priscilla. Hey, Janice. So, hey, Connie, we need normal. I love to hear you talk. Aw, thanks, Deb. Hey, Veronica. Hey, Allie. So, yeah, we um, went for a golf cart ride, and my husband said, there's an alligator, and I said, no, it isn't. That's a stump. <laughs> 
too much talk about you will cheer me up. That's right, Catherine. I am not going to talk about that. It's freaking me out. So we'll talk about something else. Hey, Brenda. Hello, Hallie. Um, so yeah, he said, look at that alligator. And I said, it's a stick. He said, a stick don't have eyeballs. <laughs> But he was right, it was an alligator and he had his little head stuck up out of the water. And I got a picture of it and posted it. If you haven't seen it, go over and look. These are smaller rolls of mesh. Yes, Dorothy, these are six inch rolls. They look about like that size. And this is about one of the only things that I use this size on because on the crosses, I think the 10 inch are just too uh, long. Did you get your hot water tank fixed? When we got home, Barbara, my husband figured out what it was. <sighs> Would have been nice to know while we were there, because I had to shower in the campground shower, which I haven't done in a long time. Hey, Jean. Thank you, girl. Glad to see you guys, too. Hi, Bev. So, yeah, he figured it out when we got home. Hi, Carol. Hi, Sheila. And uh, so we have the part on the way. Thankfully, we didn't have to call a repair person because you know how that costs an arm and a leg. So, so what did you guys do this weekend? Anything fun? Hey, May. I have some of those rolls. Awesome, Hallie. Yep. Yeah. Well, this is an idea of how to use them because. So I cut them in six inch squares. Hey, Barbara. And I'm just doing the ruffle method. Hey, Diana. Hubby feeling a lot better. Good. Your hubby, Barbara? Well, my hubby's feeling better, thankfully, yes. Thank you, Barbara. Hey, Ellen, did I say hi to you? So these are cut six inches and I'm just do doing the ruffle scrunching up the middle. Sorry, I'm late. My party just got done. No worries, Hillary. I've just started. Yes, that is fun, Priscilla. Played hunt down the paper. <laughs> What's hunt down the paper? Planner with my daughter last night. It turned out so pretty. Oh, Brenda, that does sound pretty. Send me a picture. Hey, Debbie try to get inventory of my craft stuff. Well, that's always a job, Susa. Believe me. That's a big job. So yeah, it was nice to get to see my camping buddies. I hadn't seen them in a while because with my husband being sick, we hadn't been able to go. So it was kind of fun. I have three sons all in the military. Two of them will be deployed. One this spring, one this summer. Oh, gosh, Hallie. That's tough. But thank them for their service. That's something to be proud of, girl. TP out everywhere. What's TP, Carol? Hey, Pat. How you doing, girl? So, yeah. I can't think of... I can't figure out... I Usually, I try to figure out what initials stand for, but sometimes I don't succeed. <laughs> so, if you are not following my page, please do so. We're slowly trickling up to that 6,000. Oh, toilet paper. <laughs> uh. um, so hopefully we'll get there and be able to play some bingo soon. I like to play bingo. Hey, Lisa. How are you, girl? So yeah, all I'm doing is rotating these three colors. Aw, thank you, Sheila. I miss your sweet face, too, girl. Hey, Ernestine. It was good. My weekend was good. Yep, something to be proud of. 
Pally, for sure. So, guys, I don't know if you guys played bingo with Hallie, but she sure had some awesome prizes, I'll tell you what. They were awesome. Hey, Charlene! So, I think, I know I, I know I cut a lot more, I think I cut a lot more pieces than I needed, but... That's okay, they won't go to waste. So I'm going to be making another flower coming up. Because you know we have to keep making flowers. And I'm going to make something I have never made before. Believe it or not, I'm going to make a rail. Yes, I am with with the uh, rail. I mean, not a rail. It's not a rail. What is it called? A swag. A swag. I'm going to make a swag with the rail that I got from Cracker's Convention. Well, I'm using it for a rail. I don't know if that's what it is. <laughs> Hey, Vicki! What is that cutter? Never seen anything like it. Charlene, are you talking about this? This is a cable tie gun or a zip tie gun. And I have an Amazon link under my affiliate post on my page. If you will click on that and search cable tie gun or zip tie gun, you will find it. Hey, Elizabeth! This one is about $13 or $14. It pulls and cuts the zip ties and saves a lot on your hands. It's a really awesome tool. Vicki, did I say hi to you? If I didn't, I'm saying hi again. Yes, that's what this is. It's a zip tie gun or cable tie gun. If they go by both names. So... It saves a lot, especially if you have arthritic hands like I have. So I'm going to open this just a little bit more. That's good. I know stores should be getting stocked soon. Use your knee. Thank you, Priscilla. Hey, Rosetta, how are you? I appreciate you guys using my link. Thank you, Joanne. It helps me out just to let my affiliate people know that I'm getting the word out for, for sure. Thank you, Patricia. Thanks, Tracy. You're kind of limited as for colors when you use this six inch mesh. There's not as many colors as the bigger mesh. But there's still quite a few. So this cross was uh, requested by my friend Lisa. So she actually, well, she told me she wanted blues. So these are the blues that I have. Hey, Christy. What size did you cut the mesh? These are all 6x6. Six six. This is 6-inch mesh, and I cut them in 6-inch squares. <laughs> I'm going to cut mesh for my live on Wednesday. Okay. Sounds good, Hallie. I know we needed need something to cook for supper tonight. All meat was gone. Went to four different places. Uh, I'm okay. How are you, Christy? I don't know what these stores are going to do, but the whole thing is just crazy mess. 
I'm trying to follow a pattern, but it's hard to do when you have three colors. Awesome, Veronica. So you could use different folds, different petal folds. I saw a rag wreath. I did not care for it. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of the rag uh, wreaths or bows. Oh, I know, Christy. We all are, girl. We all are. I told my husband about going back to what my mom would always do. We would have a meatless day. <sighs> oh, where did you get the mesh? I got it at Hobby Lobby, Elizabeth. There's not very many places that actually carry the six inch mesh, but I got it at Hobby Lobby. I hope all stay well. I agree, Christy, I agree. I refuse to listen to the news because it's just too freaking me out. So, I will not listen to it. So, what else can we talk about? Let's see. We need to figure something else to talk about. Um, uh, I don't know. I'm glad school is out though, because I I was I'm feeling better about not the blue cutter Amazon. I have a, a affiliate link on my page, Charlene. It's the first post. No Hobby Lobby Canada. I wonder if downsize to 10 inch mesh would work. What do you think? Yeah, you could use 10 inch mesh, Elizabeth. In fact, I don't know if you saw my post. Um, the other day where I made the pink uh, let me finish with Charlene did I finish answering you my the first post is about affiliates on my page and under there you'll see one for Amazon if you click on that it'll take you right to their page and search cable tie gun or zip tie gun um, Elizabeth I did a 10 inch mesh on my pink I don't know if you saw my pink flower uh, mesh or flower wreath on the unique in the creek board, and I think you could do that with this cross if you fold your 10 inch mesh in half, um, and then you could do this you know, this uh, ruffle method that would work. Watch the video of the pink, pink flower that I did. Hey Venus! You're welcome Charlene. Spring is coming. Yes it is. I think it's I think we crossed over uh, spring and went right into summer. Did it really MJ? Hi Debbie! Oh that's good Elizabeth. Yeah that method I'm sure you could use on these crosses if you can't get six inch mesh so you're welcome girl yep it's hot here I think we skipped we skipped spring and went right into summer it's snowing in Ontario hey Deborah we'll send some of that coolness down here Yeah, I'm going to make my first swag. Connie, I live in PA, and our Joanne and Michaels are closing for at least two weeks. For real, Nellie? Wow. Thanks, Bev. Well, I think there's going to be a lot of online shopping. I just noticed something I didn't notice before. Make it all. I would like some heat. <laughs> right, Deb? Um, hey, Terry. 
I noticed on uh, Amazon Prime, uh, you can, I don't know if everyone can, but um, you could order from Whole Foods and they'll deliver within two hours. Yep, came out of the press. Oh, sorry, just got on. What size did you cut your mess? Six inches, Janet. They're cut six inches. It's got to make snow in Ohio. Wow. That's so hard to believe with us with our air conditioner on. I know it was nice and cool in Illinois, though. It was beautiful weather. The sun was shining, and it was a nice, cool air. <laughs> thank you, Debbie. Did I thank you before? Very nice, cool air. It was 32 when I got up this morning here in upstate New York. Wow. I guess winter is still hanging on up there. Not here. Gonna be 80 there tomorrow. Easter is always hot for us. It's always hot for Easter. Did your granddaughter see snow? She did see snow. Um, what she doesn't realize is, and I'm not telling her, <laughs> it was man-made snow. They went up to a ski lodge up there. Or, I don't know if it was a ski lodge or what it was, but... Her tomorrow said it... I hear you, Nellie. But, um, it was snow on the ground that they made, so she was just loving it, but we didn't tell her that they made it. <laughs> so, she really enjoyed that. She, uh, <laughs> I mean, it was 60 degrees, so it was hardly real snow, but... What she doesn't know won't hurt her, right? <laughs> well, I'm glad she got to see that anyway. I'm wondering how they kept it cold. Because it was, I mean, it was definitely, you know, definitely looked like snow. I just got some happy mail from Bakelage. First one I got ready. Next order will be those bushes I want to make. Be great fun sometime. Awesome, Elizabeth. Yes, I'm waiting for the um, frog kit. I'm sure my wreath won't look anything like Damon's looked, but I'm gonna give it my best shot. So I'm waiting for that to get here. So. Have you guys been able to purchase all of your groceries that you need? Hey, Debbie. I don't think I ever heard how old your granddaughter is. She is 10, Jean. She's 10 years old. Oh, Roxanne. <laughs> well, they may not have all come over here. <laughs> hi, Debbie. Did I say hi to you? I'm sorry if I repeat, but I'd rather repeat than miss you. If I miss your comments, please repeat them. Aw, thanks, Sheila. I think she is. I really want to try out a rail. But unfortunately, she does ship to Canada. Oh, I know, Elizabeth. Can Canada has a problem with craft stuff. I've heard. Um, I've heard Lori talk about it quite often. So.
Roxanne, when are you going to start going live? Quick question. Can I use my impulse sealer to cut my fabric mesh? You can, Hallie, if it'll cut it. I know I don't use an impulse sealer, so I don't know what it cuts and what it doesn't. But I know the wood burning tool will cut fabric mesh. I don't know much about the impulse sealer, though. Your dream is to change all that. Yep. Somebody who lives in Canada, if they could get craft supplies up there, I think that would be a very profitable business for you guys. people are going live now because everyone is staying home so there's a smorgasbord of lives out there <laughs> Lori brings some in for us yeah she does she does her best to get some for you guys just gotta wrap a few more things awesome all right Roxanne she is a sweetheart Yes, she is. Thank you. All right, we got one more section. If you notice when you do a cross, I don't know if you notice it, but the top part comes out to the top, the bottom goes out to the bottom, and the sides go out like this. <coughs> so that's how I do it. I don't know if it's how everyone does it, but that's how I do it. I was so funny it was kind of funny but yesterday on our way home from camping we stopped to get our propane fixed and the guy see I sleep with a CPAP machine so it takes me forever to clear my throat you know so I have to cough a lot <laughs> and uh, when I wake up especially so I happened to, <laughs> the guy was filling up our propane and I had to cough and he looked, gave me a look like, uh, lady, <laughs> I said, I'm just clearing my throat. It's not a cough. Where did you get your cross from? It's from Unique in the Creek, Diane. I have a, an affiliate link to get 10%, if you would like 10% off, um, go to my page click on the link for unique in the creek and hit shop now and then put connie m in at checkout and you'll get 10 percent off all capital one word debbie i did not use a full roll of each color about uh, there's um 60 i think there was 60 cuts or 60 zip ties on here i put three in each row so that would mean 26 inch pieces of each color. <coughs> so yeah, that propane guy gave me a look. <laughs> it's kind of sort of a little funny, but unfortunately I can understand why people freak out when they hear somebody cough. I'm adding a little bit of glue here and there because it um, it feels a little slippery to me. So I'm just adding a little bit of glue. Try not to stick your finger in the glue after you add it. That's helpful. We 
Let's see, did I miss any comments? Yeah, Lori is trying hard to bring in some craft supplies for everyone in Canada, which is nice. Hi, Brenda. I went to Greenville North Custom for me Saturday just to see if they happened to have the flower board, and they had never heard of it. <laughs> really? That's funny. Yeah, some of the Michaels do not know what they are yet, which is surprising. But even if they do have it and you ask for it, they don't know what it is. I had that happen to me. And they had them. They were just on the end case. Uh-oh. That was the wrong pattern, but it's okay. That's all right. You never see it. So. <coughs> About turning a unique board into a rail. Oh, yeah, you can, um, if you put two of the small boards together, you can make a rail with it like that, but I don't know how big it comes out for shipping. So, that's something you have to watch nowadays. After nearly scaring everyone to death last week. Thought she was having a stroke. Turned out it was Bell's palsy. Still relaxation. Right? Yeah, that was a scare. I know a girl who had Bell's palsy, and it took her, I don't know if her face ever really came back to normal after that. She always had a lopsided one side of her face. Oh, you cut the big flower board in half? That's a good idea. Jean, a rail is, is just, uh, I don't even know where, oh, mine's right here. It's, uh, it's just a straight, long piece of wood or whatever <coughs> to add mesh to. <coughs> but I'm talking about, I'm going to make a swag. I have never made a swag because I'm always thinking about shipping you know shipping is horrible nowadays so I'm trying to stick to things that are not going to really hurt your shipping costs so even my angels I'm gonna start making them a little smaller and I'm due to make one. I haven't made one in a long time. Finally, we have just enough and finally zing back. That's right, MJ. So I'm gonna just I'm gonna start making the angels smaller so that they'll go into a smaller box, but but also not so small that you'll notice it. Hands on and ready to cut mesh. Let's see if this works. <laughs> All right, Hallie. <coughs> Need to get some more glue. <coughs> hmm. It's still clearing my throat. Is the pollen pretty bad where you guys are? Oh, I do have to drink, Cammie. <laughs> if you knew what 
been happening on my end. Those of you that don't have gray hair would have it now. <laughs> really, MJ? Well, I know we have to keep you healthy, girl. That's for sure. It's time for an angel. Yes. More than any for groceries. The reason why is because I if panic starts at our community praying to God it doesn't I will share to those that need it because there are a lot of unemployed or not so fortunate people in our oh that's so sweet Elizabeth it's your wonderful soul girl welcome back Hallie <coughs> <coughs> The pollen here is so thick. I could just dust the furniture and the next day it's covered again. Drives me crazy. All right, one more. One more piece of mesh. Ready to start. Oh, here too. Hi, Linda. Hey, Gina. Yep. Please don't speak of gray hair. I found my first today. Your first, Roxanne? Girl. <laughs> That's nothing. All right. We got all the mesh on. Now I'm going to add a bow. A lot of sneezing and coughing. Yes. That's the bad thing. You have the pollen on top of everything else. So. Alright. So. When you started your first read, and what was it? The first person I watched was... Hot Mesh Mom. I don't know if I pretty much so told this. It does work. I'm sorry. And a bit of cutting. Awesome. Awesome, Hallie. I was scrolling through the internet. Your driveway's yellow. Lockdown. And my husband has. I hear you, Deb. And I came across um, Hot Mesh Mom. She was sitting at her kitchen table making a wreath. And I had never seen it before. Never seen a mesh wreath before. And I looked at that and I said, I could do that. My first wreath was an Easter wreath. So when it comes to Easter, then I know that it's my anniversary from making wreaths. So I think I'm going on three years now. And then I came across Unique in the Creek, and that was wonderful. So I started making them when they were when they were still wood. I became an affiliate link, an affiliate for Unique in the Creek right away. So now you know the history, right? I have to really think when I make a, a wire frame wreath how to do it anymore because I've been doing Unique in the Creek so much. Alright, we're going to make a bow. My mentor and professor. <laughs> Same here. My mom and dad on lockdown. Yes. We're on lockdown pretty much here, but... Yeah, we're staying home. But my daughter, it just makes me so mad because she has asthma pretty bad and they're making her go to work. And she could work from home to worry and pick up my boards having a visit from her. Oh, I bet. Would be nice to live close enough to Lori. So, yep. Yeah. They're making her go to work, and I'm really mad about it. So. <coughs> hey, Robin. <coughs> All right, I'm going to tell you.
take a drink. Mm. Right, Gina? You're the first designer I found, and I love how you teach us your style. Aw, thanks, Jean. That's such a compliment. Appreciate that. You're not staying home, Carol? <laughs> hey, Sandra. All right, let's make a bow. Well, I was really worried about going to crafters convention, for sure. I really was, as you guys know. Oh my goodness. I know, I'm pretty upset with them for doing this to her. Unfortunately, she doesn't have any vacation time. <laughs> and the governor tells us to stay home. He better pay me. Right, Tracy? It is a problem for working people. I know. <clears throat> Let's get some wire. say what not to do and got hooked on you. <laughs> Aw, thanks, Gina. Yep, I'm the queen of what not to do. For sure. I've showed you guys plenty of things of what not to do. <laughs> Alright, so this is a probe of the hand for anyone who doesn't know what this bow maker is called. When you're putting the ribbon on this probo, always have the wrong side against the posts. So the wrong side of the ribbon is touching the posts. And the right side is on the outside. So I'm just wrapping the, wrapping the wire around. I don't get out a lot anyway, except for church. Now we can't have church. But I have a warehouse that has four supplies. Hey, Jennifer! Alright, stay in there. Said about 10 minutes from me. Well, that should be alright, Carol. As long as you're not going into a big, um, a big group of people, I think you'll be fine. But I, you know, don't go by what I say. I buy a shirt saying that, Connie. <laughs> yeah. What not to do, right? I should have somebody make me a shirt saying that. <laughs> Alright, let's make this bow. So, you put the wire around the top, like I just did, and then wrap it around the, the nail in front of you, and tuck it under here. Take your helping hand wire. Problem being, I have lupus and bad allergies and asthma, and my adult son and daughter-in-law are not happy. I don't blame you, Barbara. I took all table chairs in our grocery store out, no loitering. Right, Gina? <laughs> Reads by Connie M. What not to do. Yep. Yes, I had, I don't know if you noticed, um, well, you may not have seen it, but when I was at Crafters Convention, I had them put uh, my business name on the back of my shirt. So I like that part. I did that when we went to, uh, 
Waterman's Loft. <laughs> I will be in a small room with a lot of people. I hope I will be okay. Hmm. How many people, Hillary? All right, let's get started. Wrap the first post. Then go over. Twist. And wrap the next post. Bill. That dad goes with me. Bill, he stays in the car. Yep. My husband never goes in the store with me. And hardly at all anymore. He sits in the car. flip it up and I'm going to go over a couple of the posts a couple times. <clears throat> Just the beginning ones. Oh, still go over that one. Oh, <laughs> thanks Roxanne. Okay. So, I'm glad I retired and choose to want, if I want an event, this weekend was to be International Design in my, oh wow, MJ, yep. They're saying now to stay away from any place that's 50 people or more. I'll go to the next post. Flip it, go to the next post, all right, and now I'm just going to go around once to each post, let's see, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. One time I made a whole bow and realized that I had one less peg on one side of the center bow of the center peg. I was a little upset. One roll of yellow mesh cut ten by ten. All right. to the end like here. I try to I know. And take care of him too. I try not to think too much about it. Yep. That's the best thing. That's what I'm doing. I'm just trying not to think about it. And I'm just not watching the news. At all. I never watched the news to begin with. But I for sure am not watching it now. Because it's just too scary. So after you get it all done. Then you unwrap the, the wire you had on the post. And the wire that you had on the nail in front of you. Pull it really tight and then combine the two wires. in the way. 
Okay. <coughs> <coughs> Really, Diane? Ah, I know, I like these color blues. Hey, my Amanda girl. How you doing? Deep pockets, but risk no. Nursing homes, no visits allowed. Same for vets. I know. I felt sorry for Katie because her dad's in a nursing home and they can't go see him. But I understand why they're doing it. You don't want to bring germs to the older people. Alright, let's get this out of the way. I know. Sorry. Uh, the, the kids do get scared. Sorry I'm late. was taking meds. I hear you, Amanda. You need to feel better, girl. <coughs> I just had this. Ugh. All right. Hey, Diana, one guy bought 17,700 bottles of hand sanitizer and 25 masks and was trying to sell the, that's terrible, Roxanne, people always take advantage of this kind of stuff. Let's fluff this bow. It really looks like a ghost town in Walmart today. Really? Floral conventions canceled. No product, no people. That's right, MJ. give this a little here I am with my tails never go the right way don't ask me why I always have to flip them all right let's just keep Keep flopping. You know, as tight as you make these wires, you still have, I at least, still have trouble with the, the ribbon moving sometimes. I don't know why that is, but it does happen. Dovetail these two while they're standing out like this. It was rather nice. We walked all around and shook our heads. Well, it is nice to have the whole store to yourself. That is nice. see what this bow does. I have a feeling 
I'm going to be moving the tails all to the bottom, but we'll see. Do you, Veronica? Yeah, I'm thinking, I don't know why sometimes these loops do move. The top ones especially, not the bottom ones. Let's get this on the cross. See what we have. All right, Carol. to the bottom. That's what I thought was going to happen. And that's what I'm going to do. Well, we'll fluff some more once I get it on here. I always have trouble with the satin ribbon. It shocks my body. Booty. <laughs> I know. It likes to move around a lot. Alright. Untangle. Come on. Let's go, wire. Connie, you have to come up with a lily for Easter. I know. That would be nice. There's so many flowers. Hey, Bonnie, how are you? So many flowers to... That you could make. He's back. I could not lie. Saw anyone at the auction. <laughs> you can't spray anyone in the face, Hillary. Oh, I still laugh about how you spray your husband in the face. Stop coming over here. Bleach here. Alright, let me get this tied on and then we'll do some major fluffing. Thanks, Veronica. Hey, Paula. How are you? Thank you, May. I might break the rules this week. <laughs> Hi, Nancy. You're doing all right, girl. Hope you are, too. So I'm just tying the wire underneath. Spraying lights all over people's face for someone who did jail time for that. Really, Hallie? Oh. Hey, Michelle. How are you, girl? You ever tried to make a calla lily? Calla lily? I don't know what that is, Rosemary. He comes home sick again. I will keep doing it. <laughs> that is so funny, Hillary. Thank you, Paula. Alright, let's do some major fluffing here. One thing I am not an expert at is bows. I'll tell you guys, I am just not an expert at bows. And camping was great, Michelle, except for the hot water heater. That was not great. Welcome back, Carol. I'm a little mad that our water heater decided to break, but thankfully my husband figured out what it was. 
Thanks, Karen. Thanks, Raspberry. This tail has to be a little bit shorter, sticking up out there. You're right, Gina. <laughs> Never ever put outside clothes in, on your bed. Oh, I know, Gina. How big were your squares? Six by six, Paula. Thanks, Bonnie. Okay. So, at this point is when I would put the... Uh... No, Sousa, there's no reason to cover the backs of these. As you can see, they're all pretty much finished for you. I cut the excess wire off back here. No, it was a, some sort of a relay fuse or something like that, Gina. He, he could have bypassed, if he would have looked while we were camping, he could have bypassed it and it would have lit. But, you know, you always think you're not going to be able to fix it till you watch YouTube. Good old YouTube. So at this point is when I would put the uh, picture frame under here. But I do think this picture frame is too big. So look at this. I have smaller ones on order. Let me take this picture out and see. But I'm thinking this is way too big. Right, Gina? I know. So yeah, I am I have the smaller ones coming. And that's the one I'm gonna use when it gets here. This will not work. It's just too big. So I will put the smaller 2 by 3 inch frame in here when it comes. It's supposed to be here in a couple of days. I should have thought to look on Amazon before and I didn't. I just kept thinking that they would get them. Big new Dollar Generals are opening an hour early for all older people. That's nice, Hillary. That's really nice that stores are doing that. So, I think this is pretty much done. How are you going to hang that? I usually glue it in, Elizabeth. I glue it under the bow. And um, this is like the second or third, I think this is the third one that I've made. You got white mesh begging to be part of your beautiful, I know. I knew I cut extra and they're all sitting back there and uh, bugging me because they're getting caught. But So yeah, if you are not following my page, please do so. Trying to get up to that 6,000. It's taken a while to get there, though. It's just slowly trickling up. Thanks, Hallie. So, yeah, that's it for this, this one. Did you forget? Oh, no, I have the hanger. It's right here. 
Thank you, girl. So one thing I want to do is I add some uh, glue to the wire back here. Thanks, Lenora. Thanks, Marion. Because we don't want that wire to be against anyone's door frame. You're trying to get a thousand? Awesome. You'll get it, Hallie. It'll come. It's pretty slow. So, it will come. But yeah, that's it. That's our cross for tonight. So, <clears throat> yeah, I will be live again tomorrow. Thanks, Deb. Um, probably, I don't know what I'm going to make. I'll either make a flower or the swag or, let me think, the swag, a flower. We don't know. I guess you'll have to tune in and see, right? <laughs> Thanks, Jean. Good night. Hey, Teresa. So, yeah. Hey, Gary. Did you come in just to say good night? Hey, Brenda. Yes. That's okay. I take it takes time. We can do it. That's right, Hallie. It just takes time. Good night, Helen. Good night, Deb. I think people, like I said a million times. Oh, I know, Elizabeth. I think people are afraid to click follow because they think they're gonna get bombarded with messages or be bothered or you know stuff like that, but. It's just showing support to us designers. That's all it is. Hey, Venus. Have a blessed night, Elizabeth. Be safe, Gina. Thank you, Sousa. Okay, we... What are we making next? I don't know. It'll either be a swag. You were at Tom's. I hear ya. I have to go watch the rest of Tom's replay. Yeah, or a flower. I might make, I'm, I'm going to make another Rita flower coming up. So, thank you, Venus. Thanks, Debbie. So, yeah, I'll show you how I attach the picture frame when it comes. Um, good night, Mariana. This one is just too big. So, I'm not going to put this one on. I have felt from the start when I brought that home and and laid it against the um, cross. Nighty night, Terry, that it would have been too big from the start. So, it, it did happen, but that's okay. So, all right guys, I'm gonna put the camera up, say good night properly. Thank you, Venus. Try to get this mesh put up because it's misbehaving and it's in the way. So, all right. Oh, not tonight, girlfriend. Not tonight. <laughs> you see, my my granddaughter's off of school now, so I have to get up earlier than I that I like to, but that's okay. I wouldn't change it. Hey, Renee. You found me through Damon's site. Welcome. I'm happy to have you. Hey, thank you, Judy. If you're not following my page, please do so. Just checking. I'm at 519. For, awesome, Hallie. It's getting there, girl. It's getting there. So I'm I'm sorry you just found me, Renee. Everyone welcome Renee. She's new with us. Of course, all, most of my peeps already left because they know I'm signing off. But click on the picture. There's three dots at the top if you'd like to know when I'm going live. And turn on your notifications. 
um, so that Facebook would hopefully let you know that I'm live. And I'll see you all again tomorrow night at 9. Let's turn, put the, pa put the camera up. Yes. <clears throat> Alright guys, thank you for spending your evening with me. Have an awesome rest of your night. Um, thanks guys. See you all tomorrow night at 9 p.m. Eastern Time. Have a wonderful rest of your night. Love you all. God bless you all. Good night.